Welcome back to some Dave the Diver. Let's play. I don't know which day we are. Day 16. Finish gathering ingredients by evening. We have all the ingredients, so it should be fine. Shouldn't matter. Okay. We have nothing to sell. Come to the villager's elder's place when the day breaks. I will tell you how to get to the abandoned cave. Find a children's ball. I found it. Repair King Long's statue. We got the adhesive. Return to Lynchen. Take pictures of Manta Ray. Where is at night? Finding the baby whale. I postponed this because it will end the day. So... We'll do it some other time. The baby will won't die. Hopefully. I don't wish for it. Okay. Now let's go dive. Let's go finish the side quests. Even though it's not needed. But I won't go to attention. Long time no see, Dave. I want to tell you that I'm back in the restaurant business, but couldn't find your number. Ho ho ho. Famous local dish of the village, Mima Seaweed Dumplings. The dumpling skin is tight enough to maintain its form even under in the water. You should try some. How am I supposed to eat it underwater? Hmm. <laughs> Why don't you try one now? I'll make you a special version. I'm always down for delicious food. Increase the base damage of harpoon gun by 10%. Ninja. Mm. Wow, it's really delicious. Feel like I'm energized. Oh, it's not just a feeling, it actually en energizes you. Each dumpling contains different stuffing, so take your pick. Oh, the effect of the seaweed dumplings dissipates when you leave the water, so visit me whenever you need the effect. Thank you, Mimo. See you around, Dave. Mima's dumplings can be ordered twice a day, once in the morning and once in the afternoon. Dumplings give you a special effect that will last until you leave the water. See what that effect is in the pause screen. percent more harpoon damage which I don't know how much it would be to be honest I don't know how much I do right now 32 well, it's not not a lot it's just 10 percent but if we get like um, a different harpoon maybe oh you're back my friend had something we could use in that case we start working on it immediately Dave Do 
just reusing the mini game. You guys remember that game where you had to like get the loop? Like through some I don't know, like wired system. And if you touch any of the wire, it's like you fail. Wow, it looks completely undamaged. Phew, looks like I managed to glue it on quite well. Thank you so much, Dave. We won't forget this. Why do we keep getting these tremors? Tremors. They seem to be coming at shorter intervals. Oh, King Long, please protect our village. There's probably some phenomena. Chambered Nautilus. Six of them. Or three of them? What is this supposed to be? Can you get me just three? Why is this times six? Do I have it on me? Oh. I think analyzing the bones of past dead creatures will help us uncover the cause of the tremors. Please find find some. Okay. <laughs> wow, it's the ball. You really brought it back for us. Phew, I w it was really scary. Kids stay inside the village from now on, okay? Okay. Guess humans aren't all bad, unlike what we were told. Hope to see you again, human. Don't trust humans. Hmm. Yes? Hmm. Feeling a bit better after eating the coral porridge. By chance? Was wondering if you could gather minerals for me. Minerals? What kind? Oh, looks like this. Need quite a bit, so are you okay with that? Um, this is opal. So that's what humans call it. It's a mineral that's often used by sea people to make weapons. Mm, okay, I think I've seen some in the deep sea. Well well, you gather gathered all the ingredients. I guess I have to thank you, human. Haha, it was nothing really. Are you feeling alright? Well, I should be able to prepare for work now, but divine tree fruit is needed to smelt minerals. The heat has dissipated because I left it alone for too long. I need to go to the divine tree and get some fruit. I'm still not feeling well enough to do it alone. <coughs> oh, I was hoping you could help me. You're talking about that big tree at the back of the village, right? What do I need to do? You're going to help me? I'll guide you. Follow me. Oh, I forgot to introduce myself, didn't I? I'm Duva. Sure, Dua. Let's go and bring back the divine tree fruit. Mm. Oh, up close, it's magnificent. If it wasn't for the divine tree, us sea people wouldn't have been able to survive. But thanks to King Long's sacrifice, we're forever grateful. <laughs> Anyways, let's bring the, back the divine tree fruit. Pick the divine tree fruit and put it in the basket that I'm holding. My body isn't fully recovered yet, so I can't wait for too long. Bring me back five fruits in time. Hmm, pick five divine tree fruits and put them into the basket, right? Time to vent. Run! Swim! Just making it interesting. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. And I fucked it up. 
I made it too interesting. Did it really have to bounce like that? Okay. This time I'm gonna do it differently. Efficiently. Not as efficient like this. Okay. That was a different kind of efficient. Dropping stuff. people will hate me. Can you stop? Thank you, man. And we got it. Great, there should be enough. It's time to go back to the workshop. <laughs> cough, cough. Guess I'm not yet well enough to travel. Anyways, thank you, human. Dave, right? I'll try opening up the workshop when I recover. Give me some time. Okay, Duva. I'll stop by sometimes. So please let me know if you need anything. Huh, alright. What's that buzzing? What the hell? What's buzzing? Sorry guys. Okay, so we're gonna leave the seahorses there, we finish the quest, register the seahorses if they're good. Oh, Sergio, thank you human, I was afraid I'd never see my pet again. It's difficult to bring your pet here. <laughs> I'll make sure this never happens again. That's good, Sergio. And here's another small gift for you. Sergio's portrait. Oh, hmm. I'll hang it up in the restaurant. Thank you. Haha, <laughs> please drop by the casino from time to time, human. It gives us luck or more money? Sure. But your pet is not that, that cute. Oh, they're better compared to these guys. Yes. I have a lot of money. It's probably gonna be gone immediately when I make something here in the smithy. said that the depths of human seas have a stone called amethyst, amethyst, which shines a lovely purple. I'd like to see it. My friends want nautiluses too. Please get me just five more. The deep sea crabs keep destroying the edible corals. Could you just defeat three? Yes, of course. Uh, deliver it. It's not like I need it right now. So you pay seven coins to be able to use a beluga. Where's the book? Which book? Oh, human, good to see you. There's a book that contains the famous words of King Long. I can't find it. I want to read it in the evening while resting. Where is it? I remember borrowing it. Borrow? From where? From Niamo's temple, of course. 
temple has many books about the history and doctrine of the sea people. Oh, human, can you borrow another book from the temple for me while well, I look around? It's called Three Are Mutant Sea People. There are, st there are mutant sea people in the basement, and as a king, I can't just stand by. I must do something. Volume 2. That's a long title. Haha, <laughs> it's a novel that describes King Long's great battles. Anyways, please borrow the books from for me from the temple. I borrowed volume 1 before, so Niyama should know. Do I still have the Beluga? Yes. It's worth it. Like seven bucks for a ride. Oh, human, what brings you here? The owner of the seed shop told me to borrow a book. Title? It was very long. I forgot it. Haha, <laughs> I understand. Kazin always reads strange books. Niamo, I was told that you would know which one as it was previously borrowed. Do you remember? Hmm, it's a book that Kazin borrowed. It might be one of these three. Maybe it's this book. Should be about King Long. Or maybe it's the woman. Because real novel, novelist or whatever. They always sexualize their stuff with a random hot drawing of a girl, woman, whatever. Mm, this book this is the one yeah I won't read it volume 2 great job on on finding it ha 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 awesome I'll read it in the evening while drinking some seaweed wine reading time it's not really a gift but please take this it's a seed what is it it's a very flavorful seaweed seed it's grown in our village Oh, might be a bit difficult to grow on the farm. Human facilities, eh? Try going to the village's farm farmer, Gumo. If you're lucky, Gumo might be able to help you grow the seaweed. Who's Gumo? Unlocking more and more stuff. Hey, Gumo. Hmm. You're asking me if I can harvest seaweed? Well, it can be harvested at the seaweed farm behind me, but I don't want to do it for a human. What an unkind sea person. Should I just leave? No, seaweed directly from here would be better for cooking. I have to try my best to convince him. This is a seed that Kazin gave me. Can you please help me? Kazin gave it to a human? Strange. I'm not sure what a human will be able to make with the seaweed, but I'll think about it if you, if you can make if you can make something that's extraordinary. Bring me a dish made of seaweed. Hmm. Looks like I have to ask Pancho. Ask the expert. Okay. So we did all the quests except for the one up there. I don't want to forward it. I mean, I don't know what will happen, but if I go too far and always forward the quests, it's just an endless cycle of doing that. And I just want to farm. I just want to fish. I can damage you.
Nope. I don't like it. Mm. I want to drop it on your head. Come on. Come on. I hope I get the tranquilizing harpoon again. It's so nice. And what I need to figure out is how to get the cuttlefish thingy. So I can make uh, the gun, tranquilizing gun. Recoil time? But it's still three shots. Some ingredients. Turmeric. Very nice. Opal. Didn't, it, didn't even touch me. I can try it out. Does it like snatch them? Nope, it's just a whip. throw them away anyway I mean I can use them even if they're like rank one like one star but I don't wanna I only get the best ingredients and them dying or being poisoned I don't think it's good going towards me. Did it want to attack me? One more. Spam. I had a feeling it's going to be this one. Let's go down. Get the op opal. Opal. Is this you or see? Maybe there's like a flashlight here. Please. Yes. Get some air just in case if some shark or something unexpected happens. No. Just a spot of seahorse. I thought it was maybe a white one. Because right now only the white one, the one I found somewhere here, 
was the strongest one? Like the fastest one. But I'm guessing down, like even deeper. And the uh, ice or magma um, areas, fire area, should be even better ones. I also need to kill all the crabs that I see. When you pick up the rocks, can be like seahorses. Line seahorse. Certain random chicken down here. What's what's it doing here? Who lost it? As long as I don't have any tranquilizing stuff, I cannot capture the jellyfish. But I also don't need it. I wonder if it's because of the quest. That's where that we're getting so many of the opals. Probably calling it wrong. Cookie cutter shark. Spider. <laughs> Snake. expected it to happen. Round seahorse. Just wait a bit. Sometimes there's a seahorse here. There's two of them. Question is, how good are they? Probably not that good.
Having a glider is good. But I don't, I don't think I need it right now. Ouch. Sneak up. I know it's like cheap meat, but I wonder how much I could have like pushed that. I cannot look into the marina decks, whatever, but that blue one or like pur purple one with the hump on its head. I only like catch that one. How far I could have gotten, how many upgrades, level ups. It probably scales like insanely or there's maybe a cap. Like how much you can upgrade one dish. Hmm. I don't know if I want to use the mine. Seahorses. Lead? Yeah. I don't know if I need it, but why not? Let's get some more ingredients. Then we're going up. High quality cat food. So it seems like if you use a pickaxe up here, it's more efficient. You get more ore. Sniper rifle. Of course, it's gonna see me, right? Yeah. Turbo. Maybe I can find some wine limestone caves. I think mostly I need salt, which is also kind of weird because I'm full, like it's full of salt, salt water. Why can't you just like make salt? some popcorn before now it's stuck in my between my teeth i hate it okay so we cannot gather anything anymore now let's go back let's go up deliver the stuff except for the seahorses
move, move, move. Move, 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 move. Spotted seahorse, you can go get eaten. Mega Mouth. I'm gonna check on the farm. Maybe I need to clear something. I don't know. Do something. There's no weed. So, let's go. Fish farm. How can this guy be at two places at once? Does he have like a twin? I did like remove a lot of fish before. Then we have two Mega Mounts. Them reproducing is awesome, I think. Not having to hunt them, like, I don't know how fast they reproduce, but... But I'm guessing the bigger the fish, the more density. Like, it's probably gonna be like 10 to 20% more and more. So I will have to get rid of all the other ones just to have a Mega Mount, a Mega Mount farm. But that's just me guessing, like, Maybe it isn't like that. Let's ask Bencho about that seaweed dish. Hmm. Cuisine made with seaweed. Simple dish using seaweed will not leave a strong impression. Probably have that at the Sea People Village. First, bring me seaweed, white rice, and sea urchin. And give them a harmonious blend of ingredients from the land and sea. Hmm, white rice, sea urchin, and seaweed. I'll have to try gathering them. I have it, but I need the white rice for the VIP guest today. How much do I have? Just rice. White rice? Or is that it? There's still so many dishes. Damn. I haven't even scratched the surface of this game, it seems. I could hire these guys as well, but I don't care about them. They're pretty bad. Let's go dive. Dive, 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 Dave the Diver. What's this? Ink bomb. I don't care. We don't need it. Need this one. Cuttlefish skin fragment. The flesh fragment of a cuttlefish. Its characteristic features... Its characteristic feature is its raised bumps. Can be used for weapon enhancement. And how do I get it? Let's go to the sea people first. Check them out. Deliverer? 
My marriage anniversary is coming up and I don't have a gift. Could you get me some opal? Every time I call it differently. Opal, opal. Where could Marrow have gone? Hmm, something wrong? Oh, human. Actually, Maro disappeared. I'm sure Maro went to the underwater lake. I'm sure. Underwater lake? Yes, it's a mystical and beautiful place. Tension told us not to go. As there's a frightening monster there. Thing is, Maro said there's a crack that we could fit through. Didn't go because I was afraid I'd get scolded, but I think Maro went alone. What a troublemaker. Where is this place? It's closed off with a door in front of it so that no one can get in. But there should be a guide sign nearby. The sign has this kind of writing on it. Please bring Maro back. The engine will be furious when he when he finds out. Okay, I'll try looking. I'm a sign with the language of the sea people. It's always the children, man. I'm too curious. Still isn't ready. This one's worthless. These are okay. balanced it still doesn't mean it's good the dwarf seahorse can be eaten Go save the child and then we'll figure stuff out. Or we have to fight something. Tranquilize the boss. I'm guessing it starts like here to the left, and then we have to go somewhere, most likely. But we'll see. Whoop. Ain't getting any of this. Is not this one? I don't know why, but they're popular with the sea people. So I need to find some random signs and follow them. I 
Why not? A little bit of jellyfish in my life. Hmm. I don't remember any signs on the left side. So I'm gonna go right. Most of the time, the signs were on the ocean, like on the bottom of the floor you're on. I want to say ocean floor, but I don't know. Is it? No, I don't want to do that. Like poison snake. BS. Here is better. Probably going to be a Mega Mountain here. This must be the sign to the line of water lake that the uh, sea people children were talking about. You said Maro hasn't returned yet, right? Maybe I'll follow the sign. Why is it crackling? Sorry, man. Sorry, sorry. <clears throat> like this? Dot lower. Poison Sniper Rifle. It's still not worth it. Oh, let's just disassemble it. Get some more money. I mean fragments. And instead I had to go to the right. Maybe I have to read it? Then let's just go right till we find another sign.
<clears throat> get some meat. Let's go up. Probably later on there's gonna be a mechanic where you can like loot it more efficiently. Is this the door to the underwater lake? The crumbled uh, the crumbled rocks are blocking the way. So looks like we need a pickaxe. Thankfully, I have one. Let's try using this. Considering it's saying, like, hunt these crabs one, so it's either gonna be another hunting quest or something else. Great, all the rocks are gone now. Looks like the door crumbled because of the earthquake. Let's go inside and find Maro. New region. I have a feeling there's gonna be a wind or like uh, a current. It's gonna throw us. Or maybe Mario is a play on Mario. It's a me, Mario. Wow, this must be the underwater lake. To see a lake under the sea, it really is amazing. Maybe I should take a photo. Camera focus, underwater lake, avoid the fog. What was the sound? Maybe I should have taken the air. Boss fight. Hmm. Uh, found it. A goblin shark. Oh, human! You came to rescue me. I'm here to rescue you. But what is this monster? I was just here to take a look at the lake. That's when. This is a problem. Looks like I have to find a way. What a janky animation. Please don't s send ads. No, 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 no. No. Yes. Yep. Fuck you. Why is such a simple game so stressful? Mostly because I'm bad, but...
What is this? Ammo? Who? Barely defeated it. Oh, thank you, human. Why are you in such a dangerous place? Well, I wanted to see the underwater lake. Get a load of this, kid. Anyway, let's go back to the village. Maru, I was worried about you. I'm sorry, I've been wanting to go. How was it? Was it beautiful? Was there really a lake in the water? I took a photo. Do you want to see it? Wow, it's amazing. Wow. I know you're disappointed, but be satisfied with the photo. There were dangerous monsters there. Okay. Anyway, thank you for saving me. I won't leave the village for now. I, I purposely said for now because they're children. They're gonna leave. They're gonna do whatever they want. Leon. Opal. Yeah, I don't know. For now, I don't need the money. Okay, let's continue this storyline. You have returned, human. The abandoned cave is an old abandoned sea people's storage. The glacier passage key is in that place. Suwam will guide you, Godspeed. Oh, I thought you fled, human. Suwam, the best warrior of the sea people, will guide you to the place. Follow me. Yeah, 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 the best one. You, I need you. Here, human. Go bring me the glacier passage key. It's so dreary and dark. Why is this place locked anyway? Mm, I'm not sure. Heard stories about some crazy sea people locked up somewhere though. Heard the insane ones attacked other sea people. But that was like a thousand years ago. Sea people only live about 300 years, so don't worry. Hmm, I'm nervous. Are you coming with me? I'm the best warrior of my people. You want me to do such a mundane task? I will stay here and protect the area. Hurry up and bring me the key. I knew you wouldn't go in. It's hidden in one of the deepest areas. Look for a more look for a room with a mural. Let me know when you are ready, human. Yes. Yes, I'm ready. Now or never. Oh, it's cold. The key should be deeper inside. A room with a mural, if I remember correctly. What a huge sea bream. Must have come through that small crack. Holy cow, what is that? The ancient pe sea people Suwam talked about. They are still alive. It's fortunate that they, st they are still locked in the cells. Should not draw their attention. This one is even, isn't even locked. You can just go around. This must be the room Swam talked about. But where is the key? This picture seems to imply something. It's 
circle. Easy peasy. Oh, the device? That must be the Glacier Passage Key. What a creepy place. I better pick up the key and quickly leave. And leave quickly. At last, playing that. Artifact hunting adventure game pays off. The movie was not that great though. Tomb Raider. Shall I return to the Sea People Village now? Or maybe in this time it could even be Uncharted. They also made a movie. I wonder if I can skin them. Should I try? Let's eat some Sea People meat. Oh no, another earthquake. Heard something crumbling, oh. Deliver key to tension. If it's making it like this, I probably cannot kill him. I would just die. No, the exit is blocked. And now the sea monsters have come out. I must avoid them without getting caught. Gadon or, or Gadon is the name of ancient sea people who were mutated for some reason. No guns or knives can kill them. Escape, escape the cave without being spotted. Thanks for the info. the statues hmm I don't think I can pass here what if I hide behind this stone statue over there I will go unnoticed hide behind the st stone statue to avoid being seen by Gadon use the stone statue when you're in danger it's not using Oh yes, it's using air, but it's slow. I'm guessing I have to go there. What? No, it's locked. Just dashing wasn't enough. Run, boy, run. Mm -hmm. 
Creepy. Why don't you why don't you get out? Bah, I knew Suwan was not going to wait for me. Anyway, I got the key. Now I must return to Who's that? Is that the Pita guy? Wait. They're robbing graves now? As if destroying the environment was not enough. Huh? That's the sea peoples. Be quiet. Whoever harms the great sea will have to contend with sea blue. And the wrath of I, John Watson. Feel my eco-friendly sea blue armor RX-93 and its power. You are an environmental disaster. Gonna pay now. You just destroyed it. John Watson. No amount of words can save that thick scout moron. That suit looks very tough. No bullets will penetrate it. Oh, the missiles are slowing down. If only I could direct it at him. Is there anything that can deflect missiles? So, <clears throat> I just need to dodge around. You have to time it. That's annoying. Yeah. Even my armor can't negate the firepower of my hyper blaster. That was a nice trick, but this will end now. Hey, that hurts. Don't be that guy.
the fuck? Suddenly just going straight at me. <sighs> My eco-friendly sea blue armor RX-93 is... I can't forgive you destroying nature. <laughs> Watching you. Nice. Nice underwear. You are tenacious. Who's wearing high-tech diving gear? Should I bring it, bring it to Cobra? We may find useful parts out of this. See a bunch of complex mechanical parts. Should pick up some samples. It's time to deliver the glacier passage key to Tenzin. It's never an end with these guys. Oh, you actually brought me the Glacier Passage Key. Swam told me that he cleared the area and the key is free to be picked up, but I guess it took you some time. Mm, I almost got eaten by nasty sea monsters. Are you telling me you've seen Gadons? Are they still alive? Gadons? Hmm. This is the dark history of the sea people. You want to hear it? Have a short version and a long version. Which one do you like to hear? Short one. Gadons are the corrupt sea people of the ancient times. That's it? In short, yes. You want a longer version? Okay. Good. I'm going to tell you the story of the Ganons, okay? About 800 years ago, the Ganons were at the pinnacle of their civilization. Our ancestors had many devices, far more technologically advanced than that of humans in the old days. These advanced technologies allow them to live in peace and prosperity. It was all possible due to, the, due to the divine tree fruits. These fruits provide the perfect balance of temperature and energy, and they lasted so long. Fruits that could only grow in the deep sea were like a blasting to our ancestors. Like a blessing. However, There are always those who are blinded by greed. Dashe, one of the senior technicians, wanted to apply the powers of the fruit beyond mundane purposes. He processed the fruits secretly and used them to modify the anatomy of the sea people. He modified the bodies of your ancestors? Yes, it all went well in the beginning. Modified individuals exhibited strength far exceeding that of ordinary sea people. But Dashe was not satisfied with modifying the fruits and wanted to go further. He wanted to extract energy directly from the divine tree. To do so, he began to infuse the extracted energy into an ancient creature called Yawi. Well, I don't understand everything, but it definitely sounds dangerous. Did King Long know about that? At that time, King Long was busy with the task of building the control room to ensure the steady supply of resources from the tree. He was puzzled at the increased performance of the workers but he had no clue what was going on then, one day. The bodies of those infused with the energy of the tree began to exhibit weird changes. Their body turned pale and their limbs twisted. They became so violent that they began to attack the other sea people. So, they are the monsters I encountered earlier. Fortunately for us, the mutated ones hate light, so they don't come near the village. King Long himself went into the control room, captured the Gadons and locked them up in the abandoned cave. In the course of suppressing them, King Long suffered fatal wounds and later died. But it happened about 800 years ago, and I didn't even know the Gadons were still alive. It means, maybe, some of them may still be roaming the Glacier Passage. And you're expecting me to go there? I beg you. Sea people have been weakened by our ranching lifestyle. Right now, you're the only one we know who can help us find the cause of the earthquake and temperature rise happening in the glacial area. Okay, fine. Thank you, human brother. Oh, and take this. It's my gift for you. 
Here, take this sea people's necklace. Wear this and the two worms in the sea will retreat. You know, the strange worms that look like sticks. That's it for now, you must be tired. Have a good rest and meet me tomorrow. I'll tell Soam to guide you to the entrance of the Glacier Passage. But why does it have to be in a necklace? Oh, wait, necklace? Does that mean I have it always? Oh, no. It's gonna be here. It's gonna decrease my dash speed. I don't like this game. Give me tools. So it makes my life easier. I want to be faster than a dolphin. Okay, let's finish this run. Do the sushi selling stuff. And then call it a day. Uh, yeah, I do hope I don't die. Would be kind of interesting after all we did and i just like drown die Except for that annoying fish, there's nothing there. Didn't even get to react. It was just murdered. But considering we killed the goblin shark, did we just like 99% it the marine so? Thing, or at least that page because we found them all you try to hurt me so I'm gonna hurt you back in real life I don't believe that like eye for an eye I mean, it depends on what happens, who does what. But in game, you can do whatever you want. Am I supposed to go up? Yep.
Can she give like, I don't know, one more bracelet, one anklet, one nose ring that stops these guys? Why do I have to have like one necklace and one bracelet or whatever? Why can I not just like cut them off? It's also a possibility. Salt. Did it just take more hits than the big one? Interesting. This one's not bad. one more ingredient there Paralyzing stuff against uh, electric jellyfish doesn't make sense. I'm scared because if I get hit. Bye bye air. has to be a way to get these so it's either buying stuff maybe a different seller or maybe cobra has more stock later on or we produce it ourselves but i mean how do you produce soya soya sauce soya beans fermented i don't know Seems like a different fish because of that, like fractured look.
I did hit it. I thought it missed. gun or just a harpoon That new move, not bad. Okay, let's extract. Extract, cook, and go sleep. Goblin shark, 700 centimeters. <laughs> What's going on? Whoa, strong earthquake all of a sudden. The earthquakes are becoming more frequent and intense. Should go check if Banjo Sushi is alright. This man. Oh, the storm is getting rowdy. Tonight the creature that gives the super rare boss card will most likely appear. Doesn't excite you as a Marinka collector? Not really. Ho ho, if you go in the evening, you'll see the vortex that was created by the storm. You'll find a creature once you go inside the vortex. Well, go if my diving skills were better, it's too bad. Then, I wish you luck, ho ho! Wrap up your day and get things ready at Bench's Sushi. Let's go to the sushi. Bancho, felt a big earthquake. Is your place okay? I took some measures against earthquakes after it crumbled last time, but I'm not sure how, for how long to withstand a series of strong earthquakes. S is everyone okay? Dr. Bacon, I was passing by and wanted to make sure you were all right. Well, it looks like everyone's okay. Dave, what about the sea people business? Is there any problem? Mm, the heat from the ground is slowly melting the ice of the sea people village. And many sea people got sick because of that. To identify the cause, I need to go down to the glacial area that blocks the heat and investigate it, but... There seems to be eerie monsters down there and I don't feel safe. Oh, sounds like trouble, Dave. 
According to the ancient records, sea people are very susceptible to temperature change. You should go down to the glacier area as soon as possible. Find out what's happening there. Be honorable to sacrifice yourself for the sea people, even if it means getting frozen. Mm, excuse me? Never mind, we can worry about that tomorrow. Today we feast and have a fun lucky time. Phew, this place is rather hot. Is the food ready yet? Be honest now, I won't chide you for it if it isn't. Here you are, this food will make your inspiration skyrocket. Haha, <laughs> looks like an explosive dish, alright. Looks nice, but will this taste justify its fanciness? Try it first. Let's see it. Michael Bay. Rah, it's coming to me, yes. Such powerful inspiration is filling my soul. <laughs> I haven't felt this way in a while. This rice, it's not easy to find such rice in these parts. How did you? I had some help from a friend. I'm glad to see you like it. If you continue making your masterful movies that pluck at their heartstrings, you're welcome to eat here whenever you like. Hmm. Quite a man, I like your style. Perhaps my next movie should be about a sushi bar. It should feature a man with a missile launcher in one hand. What, what kind of a story is that? Ha ha ha, in any case, I think I'm all set. Thanks to you. This is a Robot Samurai poster with my autograph. You can have it as a gift. My gosh, Robot Samurai! Ha ha ha. You can look forward to the next movie. Sure to be an exhilarating one. Thank you for the money, man. Michael Bay's inspiration. Goblin Shark Belly Roast. Damn. Will I be able to get more? I have to, right? This is the only normal dish. I don't even know if I want to research it because if I have it on a menu, it's going to be on the top and I'll have to cook it. But if I cook it, it's gone. Maybe I have more decoration. Wi-Fi router. It's more my style. You brought the ingredients, then I'll start preparing sea urchin seaweed rice.
here. The sea people should be satisfied with this. Thank you, Bencher. Spring to the sea people farmer. Not now. Oh, I almost didn't add any sushi. Tropical fishy su fish sushi set. Titan triggerfish, harlequin hide, coral shrub. This one's gonna be in my main dish. Just have to capture these guys and make them reproduce. How well, how bad it sounds. Shit, I need more stary puffers. Well. If it's out, it's out. I cannot change it. love these cutscenes. Is he preparing sushi or fighting a demon? What is he doing? it one more time I can only make it one more time so uh, it doesn't make much sense This dish, sea grape rice, nope, I'm gonna supply it. Oh, I don't have any more. You can auto supply it. No, I cannot auto supply it. I don't care if I lose these. This one, yeah, sure. Because five, five pieces. I have to keep up with wasabi, not like the last time. I'll do it. No. Good, it's perfect, mate. Fuck you. Finish this. Run, 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 run.
bit of wastage, but that's okay. Nobody ate these. How much money did I earn? Seven thousand. Four point nine. Come on, man. Why not a five? Stormy night, mission failed. Was I supposed to go on a VIP night? Oh, yeah. Screw you, mate. I don't care about that rare Pokemon of yours. Ha ha ha. The wind is always cool and nice at night. Sobering up now. Oh, yeah. Hmm, the radar of the sea people detected something. Oh, yeah, yeah. But it's not from the water. Just how? I'm receiving signals from this cave. This cave doesn't look like it was naturally formed. Worth an investigation. What a surprise! A murrow in a place like this. Well, it's quite different from the murals of the sea people I saw in the sea. Let me examine it closely. Picture of, a, of sea people and humans. Is this something that actually happened? Children of both humans and sea people are they hanging out together? Hmm, the sea people are giving some shining fruit to humans, perhaps? There's a device of some sort here. And I think I have seen some of these letters on the mural. This is the nice thing. I can see it without moving. Bravo, the door is open. Looks dark and creepy, but a true archaeologist archaeologist will never miss the, this kind of opportunity. Let's see what's inside. What if the door closes behind you? This place. Look at all these bones and torture devices. You must first examine the mural in the back to find some clues. Looks like the humans collapsed after eating their fruit. I don't think the fruit is edible. Humans hunted the sea people? It looks like a lot of them were killed. So that's what happened, huh? Humans could live in harmony with the sea people, were it not for small misunderstandings. Let's first bring this artifact for further research. Seems sea people made it for humans. It's from the ancient times, but it's sophisticated. Wow, this looks like a sort of breeding apparatus. Maybe a sea people device made for humans? Hmm, what's that noise aside? What? Who is that? Why is he here? Oh, pirates. What are they doing here? Raiding? Back to the boat. This is our turf. Give us whatever you have right now. They won't let us go easily if we stop now. Let's get away as far as we can.
That's what I was trying to do. I almost fainted. I must take the sea people breeding apparatus for further study. Who would have thought that's just one run, one day? Almost two hours. Tenjin told me to talk to Suwam at the village. Should check if there are any tasks for me, then head to the sea people village. Hmm? Some kind of mail is here. Should I check it? Hello residents, Blue Hole Tourism Board here. The Blue Hole is getting more and more well known. An, interesting, an interest is growing. In three days a yacht party will be held. A lot, also, as a lot of wealthy people will likely come, if there's a restaurant that can handle preparing high-class tuna dishes, this could significantly increase sales. We ask for your support until it becomes the best attraction in the world. Dave, have you read the email you just got? Yeah, it says there will be a tuna party soon. Right, and tuna is sushi's best friend. You can sell them for a good profit. Haven't seen tuna in the blue hole for a while. It's the beginning of tuna season now. We'll be able to make a fortune using this party, ha ha ha. But isn't it difficult to catch tuna? I hear that they are very fast swimmers. Ha ha ha, that's why investment is needed. In the afternoon, I will bring a tool that can catch tuna. We'll see you later then. What kind of lunatic throws away trash in the ocean? Detoxified pufferfish is just the best. Experiencing this wild popping taste for the first time. Haha, earthquakes can stop banjo sushi. Just thought of the most awesome idea. Prepare yourself for my next big one. One hundred percent. I wonder what kind of monster I missed. Which one of these? Some ultra rare Pokemon. Farm now. There's some weeds. Vegetables on the farm. Let's check on the fish farm. That's a barrel of jellyfish. You do you? White spotted jellyfish. Salmon snail. Mm. 
now we have two mega melts. The density is at 92. Now we have more space, so they, they can reproduce. Big ones. Sushi. Let's go to the boat, but I cannot do any upgrades, unfortunately. I mean, I can do some. All right. Oh, what? Thought I needed more money. The harpoon is okayish with the damage. What I would need more is this and this. Maybe even this one? I don't know. Good. I think that's gonna be it. Thank you very much for watching. Wish you all an awesome day, night, evening, whatever you're having. Stay happy, stay healthy. See you next time. Bye.